This dragon pearl is a treasure in our village. It has been with us for over 100 years now. It has watched over us and brought us peace and prosperity. And right now, I'm going to hand it over to our new village chief. is in the temple. Then let's go. the dragon pearl. The dragon pearl belongs to us. It's not leaving here. <laughs> I always manage to get what I want. Nobody has ever stopped me before. Hand it over. You could just forget it. I'd rather destroy it. <laughs> Calm down, my friend. You must be so stupid, huh? Everybody, pick oh, up the chief. Let them pass. Quick, let's get out of here. Oh, 
altogether, there were a total of seven dragon pearls. And now I already possess two of them. Now, when I finally get all of the seven pearls together, a light will explode right in the middle of heaven. Then the magic dragon will appear. Ah! When that happens, the whole of the heavens, even the whole of the universe, will be under my control! <laughs> my lord! <laughs> so where are the other five pearls? I don't know. Exactly where they are, but we'll find them. One thing I do know is that one of them may well be in the east. I have heard that deep inside a thick forest there lives a man by the name of Sparkle. Rumor has it that he possesses a four star dragon pearl. Malilia! Sebrata! I want you to go to get that pearl for me! Grandpa? Grandpa, what's up? My boy, I don't care about my own life, but this pearl is very important. We can't lose it. Grandpa, tell me what's going on. Why do you suddenly talk like this? I won't let anyone hurt you, and I'll safeguard the pearl. <laughs> and especially this magic ball. Huh? <laughs> Granddad, with this magic pole, I can protect you and the pearl from any invaders. <laughs> Good. The dragon pearl and the magic pole are precious family treasures. We can't let them be stolen from us. Right. Put the pole down. Let's have a test. First strength, and then technique. Right. Grandpa, I'll let you attack me.
But you tricked me. Well, I call that strategy. Sin. Hmm. Don't be so happy. You haven't won yet. There's one final round. I'm not scared of you. I'll get a turkey like you. Oh, you can lick my boots. Sin. Hmm. Sin. Hmm. you lost your coffee, please. That means you'll have to do all the cooking today. Okay, I'm lost again. I lose every time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the day before yesterday, we had a tiger. And yesterday, it was lion. So, my boy, what are you thinking of giving me today, then? Mm, elephant. Huh? Mm, that may be too tough for my teeth. Okay, how about some fish? Fine. Oh, uh, what kind of fish? Crocodile. Crocodile. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, come on, you guys! Hey, come on, Hey, take it easy, guys. I'll bring you bananas every day. You guys enjoy this. I gotta go catch some fish. Yeah. Oh, here comes Christmas. doing here? Riding in funny trucks like that. And they all dress funny as well. They seem to be heading in the same direction as me. Monster, 
Thank God she must be a witch. Huh? Open! <laughs> My God, what's that? Like a witch? Maybe not. But I still feel that you're different from me. Of course we're different. You're a boy and I'm a girl, you know. Ah, <gasps> you're a girl? Are you really a girl? Hmm, haven't you ever seen a woman before? No. The granddad told me that there are two kinds of people. One is boys and the other is girls. So you must be the other kind of people. Girls, right? Yes. A boy and a girl, well, apart from some physical differences, are basically the same. Oh, yes, I remember he said that a girl's chest is bigger than a boy's. But it's strange. Why should your chest be bigger? Hey, can I take a look? Hey, you can't touch me. Hmm? My grandpa said that, too. He said a boy mustn't touch a girl. He said that those who do are called... Babies! That's right. <laughs> hey, what's that funny thing you got there? It's a truck. Hmm? How can it walk without legs? Uses gasoline. Hey, hey, what's gasoline? Oh, dear, where do you come from, you jerkball? Hey, I'm not called jerkball. I'm Monkey Boy. Hey, tell me, do you have a name? Yes, of course. I'm Sito. Sito? What an ugly name that is. Why not Ato or Bito or Big Toe or Small Toe? Toe sounds so ugly. Hmm? Dragon Pearl. Hey, don't touch my pearl. That pearl yours? Of course it's mine. My father gave it to me. I have one at home, too. Huh? Do you really? Mine has five stars. How many stars does yours have? It's got four. Wow! I found it! I found it! Yeah! I found it! So my star detector really works. Is your home that way? Yes. Tell me, how many people in your family? Only one granddad. Only one granddad? Oh, no. Hey, what's wrong? I saw a funny truck earlier on, and those people look mean and nasty. They were heading towards your house. So what if they were going there? I think those people were after your dragon pearl. That means that your granddad could be in danger. Will they kill granddad? It's possible. Come on, take me to your house. <sighs> hey, wait for me. I can give you a lift.
Monkey Boy. Grandpa! Where's Grandpa? He's disappeared. <laughs> and the pearl? My boy, I don't care about my own life. This pearl is very important. We can't lose it. Tito, tell me who these people are. I've never seen them before. They all dress in a funny way. Where can we find them? I think they came from the west. They're probably heading back. <laughs> Now, do you know where they've gone? I don't know. Okay. Well, they better just sit there. We'll find them together. You know, you're clever. If you hadn't gotten me these wheels, we wouldn't have come this far. Hey, you want some jerky? I'm not hungry. You miss your granddad? He found me in the forest when I was just a baby. He brought me up, educated me and taught me Kung Fu. And now, he disappeared. I don't even know if he's alive. He's all I have in this whole world. So you're an orphan. Well, I suppose you don't know who your parents are. And I don't know. Hey, don't worry. I'm sure he's still alive. Hmm? How do you know he's still alive? But you couldn't find his body anywhere, right? So, I'm sure he's still alive. I hope you're right. I hope I'll find him soon. Maybe, if we find the pearl, then we'll find your granddad. You haven't eaten anything. Come, try some beef jerky. This is very tasty. How do you make this beef jerky? But this is not beef. Huh? Well, then what is it? It's spider mixed with gecko. <laughs> You're a pretty girl and so cute. I want you to be my wife. <laughs> I don't want to marry you. You're too ugly. Anyway, I'm too young to be married. Never mind. I can feed you and fatten you up when you 
grown up, then you can marry me. <laughs> no! Get away from me! Then you marry me, or I'll eat you up! Hey, somebody's yelling for help. Yeah, I heard it too. Hey, I'm gonna go take a look. Hey, be careful! I never mentioned that there were men as dark as this. Wow, look at that nose. He's just like a pig. He's a monster! Hi! Little boy, keep out of this. Do you know this girl is my bride to be? Bride? Hey, what's a bride to be? You silly boy, don't you even know that? <laughs> that monster must be trying to take advantage of her. Go teach him a lesson, and I'll explain to you later what a bride to be right. is. I don't want this little princess now. I want this big lady here. It hurts, you know. I've been king of this land for years and nobody's ever hit me. Let me tell you, every meal I have to eat a cow and two goats plus three horses. Run away, or I'll come and eat you alive, you know. Go on, run! Right, I'm gonna come and eat you all up! Okay. Oh, yeah, really? But you said you were going to eat me. Uh oh. I was just bragging, sir. Actually, I may look strong, but I got the heart of a chicken. Please don't hit me anymore, sir. I'm scared. Oh, yeah? <laughs> but you had the gall to try and take advantage of her. I have a weakness. I like girls, especially pretty girls, so that I may have pretty children. <laughs> I just can't resist pretty girls like you. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't control I'm myself! Sorry. I can't... Oh, but I promise, with your help, sir, I'll try to change! I don't think you'll change! Uh, uh, sir, please don't scare me! I have a weak heart and a high blood pressure, too! Please don't hit me, sir! I'll call you master, okay? Sir, I'm very good at kissing asses, you know that. I can make you feel very special! <laughs> I don't like people kissing my ass. Uh, that's okay. I've got other skills, and one of them is I know magic. I can change into other things, so if you're bored, I can keep you entertained. Hey, I'll demonstrate for you right now. Listen, this will really open your eyes. Me, 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 me. Who's that? Another one? Yeah, he's not so bad, is he? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Using tricks is one of my specialties as well. All right, I'm going now. Huh? You won't get away! Now you 
you've changed into a fatty. This is my original self. Uh, I'm the 91st descendant of the Pig Fairy, sir. And they call me the Pig-Headed Wizard. The Pig Fairy? Hey, Grandpa said I'm the 91st descendant of the Monkey King. Oh, so that means centuries ago, your ancestor and mine were brothers. Hey, so that makes us brothers. Huh? Who's that? What am I doing here, brother? Let's go! Uh, hey! Hey! Hurry! Hey! 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 Glad to know. So leave your valuable. Then I'll spare your lives. Oh no. You got money. Hmm? What money? Uh, oh God. Listen, kid. Huh? Uh, I'm me, brother. You come through good, isn't it? Maybe you can beat him. Of course I can. We've got money, but you can't have it. So there. Then I'll send you to hell. Ah, another show. <laughs> You're not so bad. My bullets never miss. Oh, brother, you're wonderful. I shall be your disciple forever. <laughs> hey, bandit! Show us what else you can do. Oh, my goodness, sir. Looks like you've got yourself a rival. Shut up. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Monkey boy, who is he? He's Westwood. Westwood? Wow. He's so good looking. Huh? What? You call that good looking? Ha! Huh. How about this? <laughs> uh, come on, what'd you do that for? Hmm? <sighs> master! Master! Are you okay? Are you hurt, Master? Oh my god, Master! You hurt? Are you hurt? Westwood? Oh, now you're in big trouble! You found two girls! Huh? Westwood? Are you alright? Huh? Can I become your friend? This is the first time I've seen a man who's so excited about me. Can I become your friend? Can I? That girl! That girl, where? Where is she? Oh, I see it was you, wasn't it? Hey, Come what here! Are you doing? Come here, you nasty bird! I'm, I'm sorry, I won't do it again! I'm warning you, don't ever do that again! I'm tough. I'm afraid of nothing, except for women. I have a phobia about women. I'm all shaky in front of them. How can I teach big things? Master, whose kung fu's better, yours or that monkey boy? I'm not finished with him. I'm gonna go back and fight him. Jade, hmm? you're so young. What are you doing here on your own? Where's your family? I have no family. What's that? We all have a family. Well, actually, I had a good family. I had a very good father and mother. And we lived in a peaceful village. But the baddies destroyed it because of a dragon pearl. Dragon pearl? Bad guys? Who are these guys? The leader is a terrible monster. He has hundreds of mean fighters. They killed everyone in the village, and then they blew up the village. My father, in order to protect the dragon pole, stayed behind and was killed too. My mother went back for my father, and then she was killed. The monster took our dragon pearl. It turns out he also owned a dragon pearl. Both my parents are dead. My home is destroyed. <laughs> so I've been wandering on my own since then. I've nowhere to go. He knows. Mm -hmm. Could it be the same people who stole my dragon pearl? It's gotta be. So then... They took the pearl from Jade's village. Now they've stolen Monkey Boy's pearl, too. That means they have three dragon pearls now. And I have one pearl. Monkey Boy, there are seven pearls. Seven? Didn't you know that? No, I didn't. Grandpa said I must protect it. He never mentioned to me that there are seven pearls. There are seven altogether, and there's a secret about them. It's said when the seven pearls are put together, the sky will open up and a huge dragon will appear. When you see him, you can make a wish and ask for anything. Is that true? I've heard that before. That must be the reason that evil monster steals the pearls. That must be it. That evil monster. We must try and stop him. He can't succeed. But that monster is too powerful for us. We'll need to get outside help. My mother told me to go to the Turtle Man. Only he can kill the monster. Oh, did you say Turtle Man? That's right. T-U-R-T-L-E-M-A-N? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Piggy, do you know him? No, I don't. You idiot, and oh. I thought that you knew him. But I... I know where he lives, though. Piggy, mm. tell us where. Yeah, come, come on, on. tell us. Now, about this turtle man. He's a real master of magic, and his kung fu is the best there is, huh? But still, he's a sex maniac. Oh. He's many times worse than me. Come, Piggy, uh, come on, tell us where this turtle man is now. 
I've heard that he lives on an island in the south. I'm digging for treasure. I got this a long time ago. I never knew it was so powerful. I'll get all seven of them and make a wish. Master, do you want to rule the seven seas and be king of the world? I'm not interested in that. I don't want to be king. Ha! Then you can make a wish to the dragon. Ask him to give you all the money in the world. Then you can be the richest man. I don't need money. And I don't want fame. And I don't want fortune. I want the dragon to give me courage. So I don't shiver in front of women. No more fear. Ah! I don't understand, ma'am. Alelia just reported that she found a girl named Sito. She possesses a dragon pearl. Mm -hmm. So where is this girl? They've gone to seek help from a wizard turtle man to fight against us. Mm -hmm. They want to fight us? Then we'll get them first! I order you, go to the four corners of the world and find me pretty girl. Ah, come on! Hmm? Hey, 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 lazy bounce. Don't want to move, do you? Go! <laughs> you idiot! I'll get you for this! gonna pay for this. Just you wait. Run. You won't get away. I'll find you wherever you are. <laughs>
dirty. You fight dirty. You're no gentleman. Ooh, but you're a sneaky little thief. You want to steal my magic clown. <laughs> you asked for this. <laughs> I'm no thief. I'm looking for a man, the turtle man. Ooh. You want me? You're the turtle man? Oh, I guess you must have come here to try to learn from me. Huh. I don't take students. Go back, son. Hey, turtle man, I didn't come to study. Someone told me the Yo Kung Fu is very powerful. <laughs> and he wants to challenge you. If he beats you, then he'll be famous. So someone wants to challenge me. Who is he? Tell me, who is he? He'll be here very soon. He's coming now. Okay, I'll show him. That's it. That's where he lives. Which way? Hmm? Are these the people who have come to challenge me? Yeah, that's them. Oh. Guess what? Watch the show! He must be inside the house. Let's go and find him. Hmm. Hmm. I hear that one of you want to challenge me to a duel. Is that right? Is it you? <gasps> me? <gasps> oh, no, sir. Not me. It's not you? Then it must be. Oh? Me? in the right places. What a beautiful figure. Oh, my whole body is aching and itches. Well, oh, it's itchy here. And itchy here. Oh, I'm itchy all over for you. Oh, lady. I'm sure that somebody isn't you. Don't be afraid. You're such a cute little thing. It can't be you, can it? It must be you. No. Me. Hey, look here. I don't even know you. Why would I want to fight you? That's right, sir. We came here to ask for help, not to challenge you to a duel. Huh? Oh, dear, what's going to happen now? <laughs> I believe you. I have no reason to doubt anything you say. <laughs> but then Wide West would tell me one of you wanted to fight me. Westwood? Where is he now? I know where he is. Westwood's hiding. He's hiding inside the bedroom. Inside the bedroom. Westwood? Uh, hey! Huh? Westwood? Westwood? He's hiding under the bed! Under the bed! Under the bed! Westwood! Westwood? Westwood? Huh? You told me one of them wanted to challenge me to a fight. So tell me, who was it, huh? Westwood. Huh? I know. <laughs> it can't be this pretty young thing, right? So who? Tell me. Come on. It's him. You lied to him and frame me. I'll teach you. Hi. Then you two must obey! 
I would have won if it weren't for her. Why don't you let a turtle man and say I want to fight him? You said you wanted to meet him. Yeah, but that doesn't mean I want to fight him. Hey, that's enough. Don't argue. One thing's for sure. One of you must be lying. I have a way in which to find out which one of you here is the liar. Moonwalk magic! Must have magic in those shorts. Magic! What's that? You're stupid. You know, do you? It's his magic cloud. Right! I captured this cloud many, many centuries ago, and I imbued it with magic powers and turned it into my private car. <laughs> and the magic cloud has one specialty. People who are dishonest and who have an impure mind will never be able to get on that cloud. Oh, uh -huh. so then, do you think you can sit on it? Huh? Me? Uh, oh, of course I can. I'll show you now. <laughs> See this? I'm an honest man. My mind is pure, too. That's why I'm able to get on this cloud. Right, go! Move it! Go on! Ah! Oh, 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 wow. God damn you lazy bones! How could you make a fool of me in front of a pretty girl? <laughs> Mister, I'm afraid you can't sit on it. You got a dirty mind. <laughs> yeah. Who says I got a dirty mind? Actually, I'm very kind. But then... Whenever I see a pretty girl, I... When you see a pretty girl, you have evil thoughts, is that right? Yeah, that's correct! Hey, so as I said, it won't allow anyone with ugly thoughts on it. <laughs> hey, now you two try it. Whoever falls down off the cloud is obviously the liar, all right? Westwood? Huh? You first! Me! Go on! <laughs> liar. The cloud won't even let you get on it. You must be a delinquent. So then, you know the truth. He's a liar. Shut up, kid. Maybe you're worse than him. Try it. Okay, I will. Yeah! <laughs> hey. Hey, look! I'm standing on it! <laughs> hey. Hey. Mm, that's great. That's good. Uh, hey, you're going nowhere. Now, kid, you try this. See if the cloud will listen to your orders. Ah, wonderful! <laughs> He's all right! <laughs> Where's Monkey Boy gone to? Mm. Oh, there he is! He's back! He's back! Yeah. <laughs> well done! Well done, Dr. Very good! <laughs> Turtle Man? Now you know I didn't lie. <laughs> You're quite right. You're the one who was telling the truth. So, what do you think about my magic cloud, then? Not bad. It's obedient. Hmm. But he's not obedient with me, though. You lazy bones, you're no good. Ah, you're no use. I may give you away to him. Really? You give it to me? Ah. Well, anyway, it never listens to me. And sometimes it even tricks me. Hmm. Now, listen. This lazy bone seems to like you a lot. So why not? You can have it if you like it. Oh, thank you, Master. <laughs> Magic Cloud, you can go home now. When I need you, I'll call you, okay? Whoa! Oh. <laughs> God damn you! God damn you, son of a jerkball! I've trained you for so many years. When I summon you, I have to dance for hours to please you. But now you jump when he tells you to jump and fly when he's gonna fly, you jerk! Ha! Why do you treat me like this? You got that son of a bitch! What's wrong? So why did you lie to me? Huh? You better tell me everything. If you lie to me, you'll never get out of here. Master, I didn't mean to lie. I heard them say they'd come for you. So I tried to make you fight with them. I didn't mean any harm. I only wanted to get their dragon pearl. Huh? Dragon pearl? Mm-hmm. 
You have a dragon pearl? Yes, I have a five-star pearl. My grandpa had one, too, but the baddie stole it from him. My villain had one, too, and the baddie stole it from us. Now these bad people have three pearls, and they're trying to find the other four pearls. I heard that your kung fu is good, so we came to ask you to help us to stop these evil monsters. Mm. They destroyed our village. Master, please help us stop these evil people. Hey, little girl, get up. There's no need for that. <laughs> Don't you worry. That monster may have three pearls, but they're no good unless you get all seven of them. You know that? <laughs> and without me, he'll never be able to achieve what he wants. Why that? <laughs> because I have in my possession a two-star dragon pearl. <laughs> without my dragon pearl, how can he get what he wants, huh? <laughs> So we found another dragon pearl. Mm. Now we know where five of them are. There are only two pearls, which are still missing. My master has a pearl! My master has a pearl! My master has a pearl! Ah, ah, ah. Just shut up. Westwood, you have a dragon pearl. But that pearl is mine. Nothing to do with you. Westwood, do you really have one? Let me see it. Uh, uh, uh. Westwood! Oh! <laughs> Westwood, without my permission, you can't leave this island no matter how hard you try. Hmm. Tell me, how did you get your dragon pearl? I stole it. Oh, you stole it. <laughs> your kung fu is quite good, and you're good looking too. But you're a rotten liar and a thief. Today I want you to redeem yourself. Now hand over your pearl to that young lady over there, so she can rebuild her home village. Then you can leave here if you like. Mm. All right. Oh. Huh? A six-star pearl. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> oh, Westwood! Westwood! Ah, what a useless boy. <laughs> useless youngsters. I would give my life to have a girl kiss me. Westwood, please wake up. He's uh, useless. He's uh, shy with girls. Huh? <laughs> My pretty little lady, do you want to have this dragon pearl? If you're willing to part with it, of course I'll take it. <laughs> I can let you have it. But, uh, you have to pay something for it. So what do you want? <laughs> I've been living on this remote island and training all my life, you know. I've never seen a girl as pretty as you, so I, so I, uh, well, I, I want, uh, uh, I want to see you without any clothes oh. on. Huh? Oh, dear, you dirty old man. How could you think of something as low as that? Master, that's too much. Hey, kid, sex is human nature. <laughs> this is a hobby. Some call it a weakness. I do love girls. <laughs> anyway, it's just lucky. You won't lose anything. Isn't that right? How about this? I'll give you a discount. Half only. Only the top. So how's that? What do you say? The top half? Okay. Let me think about it for a minute. No. Oh, oh. See, Tom. Uh, <laughs> there's no hurry. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm going to wait right here. <laughs> Even if it takes hours, I'll still wait here. Ah! Here, 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 I'll be waiting. Na, 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 na. Cecil, you mustn't do what he wants. That's right. Why should you let him see your body, huh? If you strip, you should strip for me. Ah! Oh! Sister Cito, we'd rather forget the pearl than let you strip for him. Hey, I don't want to do it either. But if I don't, we won't get his pearl. Hey, I've got an idea. Peggy, mm -hmm. you strip for me. Ah? Uh -huh. Me strip for him? <laughs> If I took off all my clothes, he wouldn't want to look, even if I paid him. <laughs> I mean, you can change into me and strip off for him. So he thinks he's looking at me, but actually it's you. Wow, that's great. Do you hear me? Uh, huh? You want me to barrel for that sex maniac? Uh... <laughs> okay, but you're going to pay too. Uh, what do you want? Mm. Well, he'll see the top. 
I'll see the bottom. Huh? Hold it. Piggy, you're being silly. When you change into me, you'll be able to see whatever you like. Oh, yeah. How come I'm so stupid? I'll change right now. It's me. It's me. 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 Me, 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 me. How's this? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and see that dirty old man. Isn't that what you want? Oh, but you can't go out like that. Do you know how ugly you are? Okay, okay. They don't change into her. That old fuck wouldn't know the difference anyway. So I'll change now. Me, 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 me. What do you think? Do I look good enough? The voice note's good. Oh, that's simple. How's this? Any other complaints, then? Well, you look fine, but my chest isn't as big as that. Oh, but you know that dirty old man likes big ones. So let's just make him happy. <laughs> I'm gonna go show him now, okay? <laughs> Don't you fret, I'll be nice. <laughs> Bye-bye. Darling. Ooh. Ooh. <gasps> so have you made a decision yet? Oh, yes, I have. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Your piggy, just get it over with. It's not making him so excited. <laughs> you smell good. <laughs> mm. Dear, come on, just get it over with. I hate looking at that sex maniac. <laughs> I can't stay this any longer. <laughs> Quick! Take it off! Go off! <laughs> Take it off! <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> you sure need a strong heart. Two star pearl. Hmm. Oh, 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 she's so sexy. Oh, she's just incredible. Oh, 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 I've never been so crazy about a girl. Oh, that was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I finally really lived. <laughs> oh, hey, gentlemen, did you like that? Oh, huh? yeah. Yeah! <laughs> I like it too much! Now we have three dragon pearls. Master, do you know where we can find the last one? Uh, wh what do you mean, huh? The seventh dragon pearl. Uh, 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 what dragon pearl? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. My, my brain is totally freaked out. Ooh, I feel... I feel so good. I feel great. It's wonderful. Just great. Fantastic. Fantastic. Master, can you tell us where the seventh pearl is? Oh. Hey, gentlemen. Oh. Whereabouts oh, is the other pearl? Oh, master, master. I'm really freaked out. Master. Hey, gentlemen.
Jesus! How dare you blow up my house like that? As soon as we find the seventh dragon pearl, then my wish will finally come true. <laughs> my lord, where is the seventh dragon pearl? Don't worry about it. Now I possess six dragon pearls. I believe whoever has the seventh pearl will come and deliver himself to us, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Master! Master! Master, you're still alive! Are you kidding? Nobody can get rid of me that easily! <laughs> but still, my house is destroyed and my dragon pearl stolen! These people will not get away with this! Who's there? Mm -hmm. It's me! Oh, ah, Westwood. so it's you, is it? Westwood, why are you following us? Don't forget, one of those pearls you lost belongs to me in the first place. I have a right to look for it, too, you know. Good! You are welcome to join our group. So then, every one of us here all have a relationship with the Dragon Pearls, is that right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, you know. Yeah, you're right. I don't have a Dragon Pearl. I have no relationship with them. Then would you leave us alone, <laughs> then? We're about to have us a Pearl meeting. Uh, I gotta go. Uh, bye. I gotta tell you this. And it's important. If two of the Dragon Pearls are put together, then there will be disaster. And you see, when that happens, the other five will meet up and... And right now that monster has six Dragon Pearls. Hmm, I think... One of you here must have hidden the last seventh pearl! Not me, not me! What about you? I don't have it. Oh, dear. Where's that last pearl? Just where could it be? Huh? Eeny, weeny, oh, weeny, oh. mo, catch a pinky by the toe. If he squeals a, a pearl! pearl. Oh. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Hey, Dee, why didn't you tell us? You had the pearl. Hey, my teacher told me not to tell anyone. Hey, where is your teacher? Oh, he's very famous. Everybody knows him, including every dog and even every cat and pigs. Just oh. say it! He's Pig Fairy. Huh? Pig Fairy? Ah, uh, hmm. my teacher said... If I show the pearl, people will steal it. He said, I must find you guys. That's why I used Jay to meet up with you. I think now the time is right, so I showed the pearl hmm. to you. Now we own the last pearl that monster needs. Let's go get him! My lord, according to the scout, these people are heading towards us. They should be here soon. Malilia takes the first blockade, and you the second. Die! <laughs> Get the 
Brother, what do we do now? Hey, oh. give that to me. Yeah! Oh. West was a great wolf. You're so dumb, just like a pig. <laughs> to stay alive. Mm. Come and get it if you can. <laughs> any closer and he's dead. Master, I'm begging you. Please help my grandpa. Give me the pearl or I'll kill him. And don't do it. If you do it, we all die. Go! Master, please give him the pearl or he'll kill grandpa. Please, sir. Ah, but your grandpa is really right. If I give him the dragon pearl, we'll all die anyway. Come on, give me the pearl. Gentlemen, get the children out of here. Go! Oh, oh, grandpa! Never mind me. Go now. Ah! So, if you want to keep the dragon pearl, and he dies! Ah! We'll help you, Grandpa! I'll tie him quickly, come on! I'm all right. That monster, I'll kill him! Oh, oh. Soko, you're not good enough to fight with him. Let's get out of here, come on! Hurry up! Oh, he's in the control, and there's no use going to that. 
and they will recognize you. Let's go quickly! Wow! There's so many! Master, what do we do? Let's go that way! Okay. Hmm? They're here too! Let's turn back! his stomach. Hmm? Huh. Yeah. Oh, Turtle. Are you thinking of getting this dragon pearl inside his stomach too? Right. When the seven pearls meet, he'll explode. granted one wish. So what do you wish for? You must tell me now. Oh, well, I really like it. Jane, uh, uh, make your wish now. Uh, Dragon, I want my home and my village restored. No more monsters. And bring back peace to us. I see. Your wish is granted. I want to challenge you to a fight. Well, your wish is granted. 